My name is Jesse Keating. I work for Blue Box, comma, an IBM company, as the release lead for our OpenStack product. Hi, thanks for being here on Super User TV today. So at the Operator Summit over here at the summit, what were the new burning issues? So we had a fun session uh, on the new and interesting issues for the Liberty release. And I think one of the most interesting things that came out of that was that there were very few operators who were here this week who are running any significant amount of Liberty in production. So the number of burning issues that they're aware of is very, very small. So that session typically generally turned into a session about what other issues we're having. And a lot of those involve keeping the old releases going and building out new installs of the old release as we prepare to move up to the Liberty release. So can you please share any highlights from what you heard discussed in terms of best practices, tips, and tricks for OpenStack operators? Yeah, so what seems to be really clear is that operators are employing a strategy of segregating their services so that we're not relying on a shared pile of of operating system level dependencies to satisfy the needs of all of our products. Each service is getting its own environment, be it a Python virtual environment, a, a virtual machine, a Docker container, um, whatever the method, they're being isolated and segregated so that each one can be treated individually and all the dependencies of that one are treated independently and can move independently of the others. So it gives us a lot of flexibility in when we make changes to those and confidence to know that a change in Nova isn't going to disrupt the functionality of our Neutron bits as well. So how can people get involved and, and what's needed? So the best way to get involved is to join the OpenStack operators mailing list. There's a lot of good discussion that happens there. It's not a very noisy list, so it's, it's high, high value content. Uh, developers show up there quite a lot to try and present new ideas um, to get operational feedback on the, the plans that they have for the future or changes that they want to make to their, their projects. It's also where new information about meetups happen, um, new data about uh, things like this summit, the, the types of sessions we're going to have, the call for moderators, that sort of thing. And it's, uh, it's just a good communication hub for the greater operator community within OpenStack. And one of the, the most important things that we can do as operators is provide that feedback, that operational point of view of the open source, of the open stack con, uh, projects to those developer communities. Um, some of that's being done through a, a, a tagging initiative to try and provide operational tag data to apply to these projects, building up to the type of metrics that was shown at the summits here at, at Summit, or at the keystones here at the keynotes here at Summit. Great. Well, thank you so much for coming on Super User TV again, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Oh, thanks for having me.